Hey guys, it's Demas here, and sorry I haven't uploaded in a while. Things got really crazy. Uh, I just needed to take a mental break uh, from YouTube. But um, I'm back now. I'm hoping to start up again. Um, videos may not be as frequent since school is starting pretty soon. I'm going into freshman year, and it's, it's, it's a big deal. But we're so close to hitting 100 subscribers, and I'm hoping to hit 500 subs by the end of the year, if it's possible. And if we do, I have something very special. Um, I'll do something very special. That's right, I'm gonna be doing a Nuzlocke. I plan on doing a Nuzlocke of BDSP or Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl because it's more of a traditional type of Pokemon game, plus I don't have access to a PC, so I don't have any emulators, which kind of sucks because I would like to play Platinum or Emerald or something like that. Also, before this uh, video starts, I also would like to let you know I have a Demas Plays channel, which will pop right up here on the screen. Uh, link to it in the de in the description. I up I upload a few Let's Plays, and all the future Let's Plays will be on there. Just to let you all know. All right, let's get let, let's get into the video. I've wasted your time enough. As you see, I have a mental illness. So I figured we could start with the figures, but um, I have other figures. Uh, I have Halloween themed figures, and we're we're small. Small small just died. Um, I have other figures, I just couldn't find them, but they're Halloween themed, and I usually use them as Halloween decorations, but my closet's a mess, so I couldn't really find it. Here we have, uh, a smaller figure that I got from an Asian market. Th that was, uh, that was actually pretty decently priced. I, I probably may do a video of me going back there and buying a bunch of these, and unboxing them and seeing which ones I get. But I also have a, a cute bone figure, Totodile, Litwick, Mimikyu, Cyndaquil, Litten, Wartortle, Squirtle, Pikachu, and Zubat. Uh, and Blastoise, of course, which is the cool thing about this Blastoise figure, is that it shoots. So if you want to, you could uh, pull back the tail and it fires. Not far, but it's pretty cool. But we also have these TCG coins. Uh, here's one of Raikou. I think it's Raikou. And I always forget this Pokemon's name. <laughs> but um, this is a Charmander Funko Pop I got for Christmas. This is the Pokeball that the Smoliv came in. Great ball. And this is a Lego Nest Ball that I got, like, that I got at a grocery store. And it's just a, and it's like a Lego, it's like, a, it's a Lego knockoff. It's like Brickheads or something, but it's of an Oshawa, but I couldn't find it. <laughs> Next I have is this 1999 Burger King toy of Poliwag. He works as a water gun. Basically you just dip it in and squeeze it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. This used to belong to my uncle who grew up in Pokemania. So he has the first edition Charizard um he has like the old pikachu doll he has a bunch of old stuff he has blast toys and venusaur but they're not first edition they're based on limited but um but he also had some others i remember i got this at my grandparents house they keep toys from their kids through the years and they just keep them for the grandkids to play with and i found this one i played with this toy and i was like in second grade and there was also the Nido King, the Pikachu one, and I think there was something else, I couldn't remember what, but it could have just been those three. But those are what we, that we, that I remember. Next I have the, uh, I showed this off in my Nintendo uh, store video, which was, did very well, so thank you all for that. But then we have, uh, so yeah, Pikachu dolls in the Let's Go clothes. Uh, Cyndaquil, Sitting Cutie, Umbreon, Sitting Cutie. Fun fact about this, this is a, so this is obviously a knockoff, but it's really good, it's somewhat of a good knockoff. I got this at, uh, a different Asian market, it was like an Asian festival, placed up in, in the city, and I got this at a booth, and it's really, it's, it's really soft, but I like how it's like in like a sailor <laughs> clothing, it's alright. Uh, now, now we have um, a squirrel. This is just a regular squirrel plush that I got for Christmas. I also have this 
uh, squirrel phone case that I got off of Etsy. Next, I have, these are probably my favorite out of the collection. These are, uh, these are obviously not official, but um, I but I got this for my birthday or Christmas. I can't I can't remember, but um, because my birthday is around Christmas. But these are black. But these are custom made of the original three big trio that my uncle sent me, and these are really cool. Uh, there's Blast Toys, uh, Charizard, and Venusaur. They're very cool. I really like them. So yeah. Now we're getting into more TCG stuff. Um, I just have my computer over there. <laughs> but these are just tins that my parents got at Costco because they sell Pokemon cards here at Costco and just like these big tins and they're pretty cheap. But I'm gonna try to show what's inside the tin. It's, I think I organized a few of them. So this is a energy. Um, so this is more of a energy and like dice box so here's a v-star thing uh energy deck uh energy deck uh burned or poison markers and just a bunch of energy just a bunch of energy cards and then a bunch of dice that i got from the elite trainer boxes over there okay so in the snorlax 10 these are just random cards in here so all the so all the tens just have random cards in them um, so I'm not gonna get into them, but the binder here, these have all of my, uh, really special cards in here. Uh, I need a new binder because, uh, there are also special cards in here, uh, that are mini binder. So, yeah. So, getting into, this is a Zapdos figure I got on Black Friday at GameStop. Uh, Pokemon Premier Ball 10, tins of Hop and... I forget her name because I do not remember Gen 8 very well. So next is Monopoly Pokemon. This is uh, very fun. I love, uh, I, I haven't played much of Mono Monopoly, but I bought this back in like Target as like a kid or like Barnes & Noble or something. But, so this is, um, this is like a treat, a chocolate treat that I got in an Asian market. I can't read Japanese. I didn't know exactly what I was getting into. Up only besides this one image uh but it's a i thought it was pretty cool just to keep so same as before these just have random stuff of cards the elite trainer boxes but crown zenith vivid voltage and chilling rain all right we're getting into one of my favorite binders uh this just they have most recent cards so cloth crydon then a first edition jungle venonat a first edition Weedle that my uncle did send me. Props to him, he's very nice. Uh, Skull Villain. Uh, Luxray, Rayquaza V. And a bunch of other cards that I, that I put in here. So yeah, this, uh, thank you so much to my uncle. Uh, I don't know, he could be watching this. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you so much for sending me this. And yeah, it's really cool. This is one of my favorite stuff in the collection. This is the big binder. Let's get into it. First off, just random cards. Gyarados's Go Goats, Rabidash's Squirrels, Magmites, and Bidoof's. Uh, then you have, uh, Bunch of other random cards, promos of Vaporeon. I used to keep this by my bed. Um, uh, Flareon, Espeon, Bedov, uh, Sylveon. Yeah. So just a bunch of promos and just regular hollows. But we get into more of the heavy hitter stuff right about here. We have evolutions. Um, a bunch of other promos uh, and other cards other cards but yeah a reverse hollow nidoking. king uh i don't know which set this is from but it's torch it's just a torch check uh evolutions ponyta um last toys uh hisuian lily that i got from astral radiance uh i don't know if this is worth anything please tell me because it's i think it's a secret rare 
and this is definitely from Evolutions. This is official. This isn't a knockoff, but I do not know what that is. Um, other cards, Evolutions, Voltorb, Evolution Staryu, Drapion V. Here we go. So, Keldo EX that my friend gave to me, a Raichu, uh, Misty's Determination, Coughing, a break card from like a, I don't know which, it's like a 2016 World Tour or something. Uh, Evolutions Charmeleon. This card, this Rayquaza is a card I got in Chicago. Uh, I went, I was in, we were staying in Chicago, and my parents gave me a Pokemon pack for my birthday, because we were there for my birthday, and I didn't know how much Pokemon cards were worth, were worth, so this is in terrible condition. I don't, I don't even want to show you how bad this is in condition, why it's on the back, because I just don't want to get mean comments saying, you idiot, what were yours? I, I, I was, I was eight, I was eight. <laughs> But Origin Form Valkia V-Star, I'm very proud of this card. I put in a sleeve immediately after I pulled in Astral Radiance. Uh, and then probably one of my favorite cards, a Holographic Machamp from Evolutions. So then Doug Trio, Leon, another Sandshrew. Volpix again, uh, Nidoran. But yeah, good majority of other cards. Um, I'm about to get to some heavy hitters soon. Oh yeah. So Radiant Heatran, this uh, it took me. Uh, my uncle sent me a Pokemon pack, and he didn't know what, what he didn't know what was inside. So a good majority of the stuff in here is thanks. Thank you to my uncle. <laughs> uh, so Halloween themed cards as well. Some of my personal favorites from there. Uh, so there's a Gengar somewhere. Yeah, Gengar. Uh, Tyrant Charvi. Promo, then Blaziken V, and Melanie. And this is a promo, and this is not. This is a Thunderous V Star. Or Tornados? Yeah, Tornados. Uh, Venusaur, Umbreon v, uh, v Max, which I'm very proud of. I love Umbreon. Umbreon's probably my second favorite Pokemon. Uh, Arcanine is the first. Uh, Cricketune V, uh, Miriam, uh, Cast Form. Uh, Coridon EX, uh, Full Art, Coridon EX, EV, Trainer's Gallery, uh, Kingdra, Trainer's Gallery, and Superior. But, uh, this is probably one of my favorite cards. This is Pikachu from Crown Zenith. It's my Pokemon card collection, and just Pokemon in general. Uh, so yeah, uh, make sure to like and subscribe to this video if you haven't. Thank you so much for watching, and see y'all next time.